Hey there, everyone, this is Ram Cal playing Jump Last Time Difficulty Curves. Also, there is indeed a room somewhere in this level that has all the dragon coins tucked in, and so I guess that's how we're starting. Ah, see, yeah, I was given the. <laughs> I'm outside the map. <laughs> yeah, I was given the somewhat blatant hint that uh, that coin that serves no. Oh, jeez, wow! <laughs> the whole Donkey Kong experience here. Yeah, uh, that thing, but yeah, but, I mean, at this point, it's getting silly, it's even green up there. Doesn't mean anything, I don't know what I'm doing. But we've got Donkey Kongs going on in our mind. Oh, jeez, this is pretty amazing. I wish I was a clock, so I could stop at least twice a day and be alright. Ah! I failed! No! That gets hard. Freaking hell, this is hard. Fart. Really? Ah, uh, there we go. Whew. <laughs> Man, this, uh, this strikes me as feeling significantly harder than anything that wasn't the actual level. Oh, that was done yesterday. Maybe I'm just re misremembering. But wow, what a neat little thing to have. Like, it's so neat. Skaliloquy. Two exits, no Yoshi saving, Raveg. Skaliloquy, I guess, probably like a soliloquy, except we're on a skull, except we're on a ghost. Ghost house have skulls. Uh, okay, so yeah, it's a skull level in the spike-filled ghost house. Keep your eyes open for potential secret exit shenanigans. Keep your eyes open for secret ghost. That skull just fell. Keep your eye open for that. Super good playing. Keep your eye out for that, but you're probably not gonna see a lot of that. Uh, <laughs> Oh man, self-defeatism. Well, that's probably for the secret exit. I don't know, just spitball in here. Oh shoot, there's dragon coins too. Uh, well, I'm probably gonna die and or return here anyways, so... What am I seeing here? Jumping between the balls of a carousel is a dangerous thing to do. What the... Okay, yeah, uh, remember, how okay, you are in World 7, bricks just floating there, making a half wall. It's very nice for your garden. Maybe I should consider having my garden get haunted. <laughs> hey, they're here. He's just bobbling up and down there. It's really pretty of you. Where am I? Where am I going? Who are we? Why does it matter? All these very scary questions. Wait, what am I doing? I'm just gonna die if I, can, if I continue that way. Okay, so that's a reset. What is it that is going on? Oh, you're supposed to, yeah, you're supposed to jump over all that to be able to make it here, I believe. Possibly. Okay. This is a dangerous ground game. 
we are getting ourselves embezzled into. Oh, so countercurrent ghost activities. Not sure what's up with you, door? Uh, probably supposed to find a. Oh wow, really? <laughs> okay, well, I, I don't need to be writing it. Like, I can just coexist with it somewhat. It's actually super awkward. Okay, I did not know that that's how Skull behaved while you were interacting with them. They just kind of, they really want you to be right on top of them. They're like, yo, my top of my cranium is solid, bro. I'm gonna show it to you, whether you want it or not. And now we've got one Skull, one truth, one way to get things done. That cloud, he's so happy. But you know in the end, he's gonna eat off your face if you give it a time of day. So don't do that, if you can help it. Okay, I gotta keep up with my skull, which I did not do. Hate it when my skull runs away from me, and it happens way too often. <laughs> what a mushroom. Incredible. I never would have dreamt to see the day. Uh, yeah, I think an extra power-up can be useful, because... Like, it's over spikes and not lava. So I can, if I have the opportunity and the invincibility frames, go back for my extra power. If it was lava, it'd be a completely different story. Uh, probably not as interesting. Alright, Ghost Light. How does... You know what? That's, this is just not working. Oh, what? No! What a pro. Uh, like... Honestly, I, this feels... More doable. It's obvious. What? No! Kuno is too much on the edge. You can't jump if you're too much on the edge because, you know, skulls. Skull laws. I do not have the power to contest that. Like, I guess that's what you're supposed to do. That other block there, which is there to trick. Oh, okay, sure. That counts. Shouldn't be surprised. What am I. Jesus, hell, okay. That mushroom there, that one up. It's really popular with the kids. Why am I. What is- but night- uh, well, okay. Thank you, Eeries, but your princess is over there. So I don't know what I did to bring back the Eeries, but whatever it is, uh, don't do that again. Emphasis on whatever it is. It's those Eeries. This is easiestly done. Well, well, whatever, it works. No, there's other areas all over, all over the place, I think. Maybe. It's those guys, like... I'm sorry for, you know, going back to the left a little bit there, buddies. Oh, there was a springboard here before. <laughs> Alright. Maybe it's better off this way, then. <laughs> Waha! Oh, see, you can use the springboard to get yourself a free astrological sign! The moon! <laughs> nice. This was a really nice little level. Again, it feels easier than everything that came before in World 6, but this is genuinely nice level. I got hints and clues for what to do about, <laughs> about the secret exit. And I know where the last Durgan coin resides. Um, I'm thinking that I'm thinking that I don't know where I would be using that P-switch. Gotta think real long and hard about that, apparently. You're a normal ghost, well, whatever. It's okay. I still like you for who you are. Not for you, who, you, who, you. Well, I mean, okay. So anyways, that gets dunked. I don't know where to use this, though. Boppers. Ah! I missed it again. Can I hire the services of a ghost to help me out here? Yes. Like, yeah, no, like, it's a lost cause for the P-Switch. I don't know if it was gonna be close or not. But at the very least, I can get the dragon coin done here. It's, it's, right, it's, very, it's a very difficult challenge. It took me months to master. And time travel. Dude, dude. So where do I use this? 
I guess I'll just... Really? I forgot to... Wow, that was sad. Well... Uh, why not? Okay, so that's where you need to go. Yeah, there's a coin here, of course. That's the indication. It makes sense. Then you get here and you get another piece which I need to use somewhere. But where, I wonder? Um. Um. Some kind of clue? Somewhere? Anywhere? Okay, so then you can continue there. Good to know. Okay, okay. I was gonna say, I'm gonna try to preserve my hits as much as I can, but uh, that fell through. So I still I think you want to summon this, well not that one, but the other skull rafts are there to be skull rafted, which is interesting. It's interesting, yeah, how this part is basically designed to be played in both directions. That's actually pretty legit cool. Yeah, there we go. The door is the tell, then you continue in the scary Andy chamber where a ghost says boo, and I say, oh no. Uh, well, I'm dead. Those Aries! <laughs> like, I mean, I was dead. There was nothing, like, flat out. Oh, the part with the Eerie, though. How. Okay, doesn't let you scroll the screen, so I can't do that. my super strategy of just doing this which is easier to do while you're big because you're like one tile higher <laughs> like I don't know if that was what was expected to do but I mean yeah just get there big and do that so you don't need to actually do the little uh, scramble there oof uh, had there not been a secret exit I would have uh, kept doing with another level that secret exit took a little bit more out of me than I thought uh, it feels harder than yet than the rest of the level, but it's still super good. I really like this level here. Raveg, you're an alright guy. Next time, just do the statistics. We're gonna do that red level there. Gonna return on a con. Well, the first one treated us real well, so they're all gonna treat us real well. That's just the law now. <laughs>